In a Gizmodo article, uh, Matt Horn asked, when was the last time you really got excited using a mouse in the last while? They're kind of still maintaining the same traditional like uh, optical um, inputs and it, the last time we'd be excited would be with the new age ones which have touch pads, track pads, so they are developing but um, still slowly, it's still kind of still traditional. We learn through doing like everything in our lives is through our bodies, we experience through our bodies and this is lacking in our interaction with computers. And you know you're probably familiar with the interface from Minority Report where Tom Cruise uses gestures and to navigate a, an, interact, uh, an interface. Uh, the developers of that have uh, created a working prototype of it and uh, like with the earlier examples, again it's just about placing the body at the centre of the interaction and making it quite an intuitive experience that you don't have to, to learn necessarily. Um, but a lot of that technology is quite, it's kind of out of the reach of kind of consumers but what makes it possible or more widely accessible is the Kinect and the Kinect breakthrough is really important I think because they're no, so the Kinect, if you don't know, um, it was a, a sensor developed for the Xbox console and it allows you to interact with the Xbox using gestures and sound in a way that doesn't require a controller. Um, but it's actually got a lot of applications beyond gaming. So um, uh, a sort of community of open source developers have released uh, a library for the Kinect that makes it possible to use it on a Mac or a PC. And the popularity of that has led to even Microsoft recently releasing a developer kit for <coughs> Connect. Uh, and uh, it's got a big community of followers that are making applications, like I said, far beyond uh, gaming. So you can raise, raise that ball up. Level one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's about as good as you can do on it. It's good you can go straight to full on Jedi. <laughs> That's brilliant. That's right.